As an IT professional, you've probably made it your mission to ensure that you have a relevant and effective cybersecurity program in place to cover your organization's entire enterprise. You've applied industry best practices to the IT space, and you are now sleeping soundly at night. But what if I told you that there was this whole other space at risk because you didn't even know it existed? A space that speaks another language, that has different implications when compromised. What if I told you the environment or even human lives were depending on this space and that it's operating on very old or antiquated technology? Not sleeping so well anymore, are you? When it comes to the IT space, things are pretty mature. By following any one of the many tried and true frameworks, you can achieve a very comfortable security posture. In your IT ecosystem, you're likely leveraging some form of managed security service provider some kind of security information and event manager, endpoint protection, and next-gen firewalls. You've invested in technologies that continue to evolve and adapt to the ever-changing cybersecurity landscape, and that is all crystal clear. In the operational technology space, otherwise known as the industrial control system space, however, things become blurry. To simply understand what you're dealing with, you'll have to have conversations, read specifications, or reference manually updated Excel sheets. Your investigations will slowly reveal that what's running on the factory floor, machines, robots, conveyors, and what have you, are all operated by ranging vintages of controllers. The risk elevates when these aging controllers are networked to external systems, the business network or cloud services, to bring intelligence to the factory floor. Herein lies the challenge. What you think you know is hearsay. It's subjective, and those responsible for it generally don't fully understand how great a risk exists. To make matters worse, they may prefer that IT stay out of their space altogether. With all that said, there are emerging technologies to solve this set of problems. Their greatest value is that they bring visibility into the OT space. The technologies uncover the assets you have out there. They remove the ambiguity and allow you to start measuring and consequently start managing the risk while allowing operations to meet their goals. The second biggest advantage that these technologies bring to the table is detecting change. Knowing when something is operating outside of normal is critical to ensuring safe and stable operations. When implementing this technology, our first-hand experience has shown that inside an hour, you uncover things you never expected to see. First, that there are devices on your network you didn't realize you had. Second, that there are communications going on between machines and devices that you didn't know about. Third, that the amount of change occurring on your operational equipment being done by engineers, maintenance, or third-party vendors is absolutely mind-boggling. With this new level of visibility, you are now in a position to implement new policies that will help you manage your vulnerabilities more strategically, respond to incidents more rapidly, and recover more successfully. Let's be clear, implementing the technology is the easy part, and it's only a piece of the puzzle. Leveraging data captured, tuning the baselines, and producing insights to manage the risk will require you to wrap the technology with both the right people and processes, a necessary step to improve the effectiveness and relevance of your cybersecurity program. We understand it can be overwhelming, even intimidating. So if you're interested in learning more, please reach out and we can help you get started on your journey into the OT cybersecurity space.